Hi everyone and welcome to the mini toy love channel and today I'm gonna be unboxing the new mini brands mini convenience store play set display set however you want to use it but this one's looks super cool I like how it's mini it's not like the big grocery store but I realize now like you can probably connect them together you can have the grocery store the toy store the mini mart store I think that's awesome and this one has a total 7-eleven vibe with the green orange and red you get a lot of cool pieces including like a hot dog area the freezer section as well as one exclusive mini so let's go ahead and get started the back of the box shows you everything it includes which is cool I think it'll be pretty easy to assemble it's also taped along the side Ooh, and here we go oh wow it comes in like little blind bag compartments what what fun is this how cute I was not expecting that. <laughs> Let's get those out. In total, you have eight of these like blind baggies. That is so cute. And you also get a bunch of decals. I love it. As well as your instruction booklet. So yeah, there's, there's a lot to assemble, but usually these pieces are pretty, pretty standard for mini brands. Oh, so cute. It doesn't show a certain order to unbag these. So I'm just gonna start with the biggest one. They even include like a little like, hair tab. How cute, oh my gosh, a piece jumped out. So I think this is our base floor set. Okay, so the main floor base is assembled out of that first blind bag. Then I'm gonna grab the second biggest one. <laughs> We're looking for the sign, we're looking to build up. So let's see, oh yeah. So this comes with like the clear door. So we have this piece, which we're definitely gonna need our decals for. So we have the facade of our convenience store. They want you to assemble this last because I think you got to put all your, your stuff inside. Be careful with the decal. Um, it's very unforgiving. I messed up a little bit once. You can kind of see a crinkle there, but other than that, if you're patient with it, it will line up and look pretty good. <laughs> okay, next bag. Let's see what we have to assemble here. Oh, looks like we have some counter stuff, or it might be the hot dog maker. <laughs> in that bag we had the pieces for like the hot dog or hot food vending area as well as the cute little microwave which it does have a door that opens so a spare piece which i think is going to go with the cash register wherever we find that so let's grab our next pink blind bag and open up this okay i think this is the freezer and here's the cool freezer put together. It requires three decals and the door is open. You can store your frozen goods inside. And the way they made the blind bags makes it super fun to, to build this playset. I love it. We have two more pink blind bags. So here's our last big one. And oh, it looks like we have some of the countertops. So we have two large countertop pieces. Then we have our last pink bag and then two blue bags. Now I think this is going to be our little exclusive mini that we get. Let's... Oh, that did not open. <laughs> Come on out, little guy. And fun, we have Jolly Rancher hard candies. Cute. So I don't know if this flavor is an exclusive because I know you can get Jolly Ranchers. Oh my goodness, how cute is that? In the capsules. But either way, that's adorable and that will go nicely in our convenience store. Which leads us to two more blind bags. Let's open this large blue one. And oh, inside is all our shelves. So those are a lot of pieces. <laughs> and here's our shelves all assembled. I like how they grip together. So we have four standard shelves, which are like putting together the ones you can find in the capsules. And then we have this $2 clearance rack which that's fun. And uh, together they just make the, the rack compartment here. Okay, and then there's one more blind bag to put together and then we can assemble everything. And I think these are gonna be like the mini pieces and stuff. Oh yeah, we have a lot of shopping baskets. So we have shopping baskets and our little drink slushy dispenser. Oh, that's fun. <laughs> so you get one basket, but you can mix and match those with other mini brand baskets. You get your slushy machine, which that lever works, super cute. We have our register as well as our drink dispenser. So now it's time to put everything together on our base. And everything snapped together rather nicely. So here's the store facade. And I like how you can have little minifigures. I just have Bad's Maru here to go shopping, although it's an empty store. So he's sad. And you have your big center console with all your shelving units. 
And back here is your freezer, your drinks, the hot dogs. Let's get some stuff inside so we can decorate. We have some almond milk in the freezer section. What's nice is that these are adjustable shelves, especially the almond milk is, is big. We have some cheese, some baby bell can go up there. We have a little, little cheese wedge from different series. I like how you can mix and match and then we can close up the freezer. And overall, this is just a super cute little playset. You can make some fun scenes. Bads Maru found some sour candy for him. We have our fun and yummy display. This is like my type of shelf. We have our freezer goods. Your characters can come around and do little slushies and stuff. They don't come with different cups, but this would be a really good match for, for some remint sets as well. And then in here, we have our hot dogs, although you should probably take them out of the package <laughs> before you put them on the grill. And then we're gonna cash out with some Tapatio. So there you have our mini brands and mini mart convenience store. Super cute. Overall, it was actually a lot of fun to build, partly because of the blind bag element. It keeps you going, it keeps you motivated, and it just makes for a super cute display. Again, you can mix and match different pieces, whether it's remint, mini brands, other mini food items. Shopkins will work really well too. And it's just super fun. It's not a huge playset where it's gonna take up a lot of space. So I definitely like that aspect about it. Plus, I just love the 7-Eleven vibe. So if you're a fan of mini brands and are looking for a fun way to display your items, I, I do recommend this. It's gonna make for cute photos as well. And that'll do it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, feel free to give it a thumbs up. And I want to thank you guys so, so much for watching. I really appreciate it. And I hope to see you next time. Bye-bye.